Hey guys, in today's video, I want to show you how to use an Apple Pencil with an older generation iPad and an iPhone. Now, as we know, iPhones do not support Apple Pencil at all, and only selected iPads can use the Apple Pencil. But for the last couple of days, I've been using a home remedy, I guess you can call it a life hack, that allows me to use the Apple Pencil on the iPad and even on the iPhone. Now, this is a little crafty. It's not the most nice looking thing, but it does get the job done. So first, how do we do it? Let's go ahead and move these out of the way. And you're going to need, of course, the Apple Pencil or a stylus and a paper towel with a little bit of water this is stuff you can find anywhere paper towel and water so you're gonna grab a paper towel you're gonna fold it and then you want to go ahead and rip it in half once you rip it in half all you have to do is go ahead and fold it one more time and one more time like that right so what you want to do now is go ahead and grab the Apple pencil and you want to place it so the Apple pencil is sticking out just a little bit out there right there just like that and then fold it in itself just like this right so once you fold it you want to make it so that it's really tight kind of twist it a little bit until you get something that looks like this right here which I already prepared is basically a mold of the Apple Pencil itself. Now, if you use a thinner napkin, uh, it's easier for you to get the mold properly, and then you can reuse it every time. Let me see if I can get a good image of this for you guys here in the camera so you see what I'm talking about. See, the tip of the pencil is barely sticking out right there, and the paper towel is wrapped around it. Once it dries, it creates sort of like a mold, and uh, it's not the nicest looking thing, but number one, you can use it on the iPhone, and it works and also older iPads and you don't even have to charge the Apple Pencil. So what you want to do now, here's where the water comes into play. You want to go ahead and uh, make it so it's damp. So let's go ahead and dip it into the water so it's damp. Okay, so once it's damp enough, now we can go ahead and try it. Let me go ahead and show you that. So there it is, the napkin. The tip of the pencil is barely sticking out. Let's see if this camera can focus on this. The tip of the pencil is barely sticking out. Right there it is. And it's not the most beautiful looking thing but for a home life hack it does work and again you don't have to charge it so let's grab the iPhone here and see if we can get the iPhone to work with the Apple Pencil there it is we can scroll through pretty easy go in here maybe create a note there we go and the purpose behind this is because the water surrounds the tip of the pencil when you touch it with your hands it creates the contact that it needs to create and then it draws. So now let's go ahead and try the iPad and see if we can get it to work. There it is. This is like a third generation iPad, by the way. I can use it just like that. It's very responsive, by the way. And that's just a quick life hack, something I wanted to share with you guys. I thought it'd be fun to share with you guys on how to get an Apple Pencil to work on an iPhone with a simple life hack. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.